So basically, there are two types of foundation. One is shallow foundation. Obviously, shallow foundation means the depth of the foundation is shallower compared to the one which is termed as deep foundation, right? The foundations are very, very deep. Example of shallow foundations would be like spread footing, mat foundation, raft, or sometime known as raft, R-A-F-T, raft foundation. It's the same thing, right? And the example of deep foundations would be your driven piles or drill shaft and pier. So what is the difference between these two? Shallow foundation is obviously your depth of the foundation amendment is shallow. This is dictated by the bearing capacity of the soil plus as well as the frost depth. If you look at the United States, if you look at the north, the frost depth is different compared to the south. So depending upon your locations, the foundation, shallow foundation depth is also dictated by the frost depth. You might have a very good soil, so it may not require the deeper than your frost depth, but building codes will uh, require you have the foundations designed to show the, to prevent from the frost depth. So these are the requirements for your shallow foundations. Deep foundations, these are the basically for the depth students on geotechnical parts, so we'll talk about deep foundations with the students who are interested or would like to give their PE exams on geotechnical parts. So for your exam specification, we'll stay with the shallow spread footing. Okay, so you can read it. Shallow foundations depth is shallower than the width of the foundations, whereas in case of the deep foundations, depth of the foundations, DF, is larger than width of the foundation. Generally, your DF by D ratio for the deep foundation is greater than or equal to 10.